Hey, what's up beautiful people? Um, thanks for taking the time to stop by and check out my recording. Um, I will just throw out a quick disclaimer there. If you have seen an intro video with me wearing the shirt, 99% uh, sure it's probably the same intro video. Um, so if you want to, you can just fast forward ahead to the recording if you'd like. For those of you who are new, welcome. Uh, my name is Anthony Chow. I am a violinist here in Omaha, Nebraska. Thank you very much for taking the time to uh, check out my recording. Before I get into the purpose of these videos, uh, just a little bit of background about me. Um, I am originally from Kansas and I studied at Fringe University with the fabulous Valerie Sullivan. Uh, I got my violin performance degree there and also my music business degree. After that, I went to the University of New Mexico for grad school and I studied with the phenomenal Dr. Carmelo de los Santos. There was a time after I graduated when the music world kind of was a little rocky. So at that point, I decided to start my own online business and I pretty much exited the professional music world for about five years. One of the purposes of these videos is because I always have friends and family who are always asking to hear me play. The second purpose for these videos is that um, just where my business is at right now, I'm able and wanting to get back into the music circles a little bit. I am definitely interested in doing some freelance gigs, perhaps with some churches or music theater, maybe a lot of weddings. Um, so if you know anybody who may need a violinist, I would greatly appreciate it if you shared my videos with them. Some recordings that you're not going to hear on this channel are gonna be major works like concertos, sonatas, some of those famous show pieces. You'll also notice that a lot of my recordings are probably going to be solo violin. Um, I just don't want to take the time to find a collaborative pianist. Something else you're gonna notice about my recordings is that I'm not gonna have a lot of video to my audio sound. There are three basic reasons for that. The first reason is that I'm doing all these recordings in my apartment, and to be completely honest with you, I'm probably not completely dressed when I'm recording these. The second reason, uh, a lot of these recordings I'm gonna be doing in my kitchen. I think my kitchen has the best acoustics in my apartment, and there's nothing really that interesting in there. And the third reason, um, and this is just my personal opinion, but I honestly believe that when you have a visual to music, it kind of takes away from the musicality of the piece. There's so much going on visually that I think people don't really get the opportunity to really hear what's going on in the music. So now that I think about it, not having visuals may potentially work against me. It's a very humbling experience for me to record myself and re-listen to my recordings. So with that being said, um, all my recordings are raw recordings. I'm not doing any editing, any mixing, any equalizing. Obviously you will hear that not all my recordings are perfect. Um, if you have any suggestions on how to practice certain areas, I am all ears. Um, just kind of post down below uh, what you suggest. So one of the things that I think is really fun about being a musician is that you're just never arrived. If you guys have any cool videos of musicians who are um, doing a certain technique, maybe an effect, post their video down below. Um, I would love to take a look at it. If you would like to, please subscribe so that way I can just change my YouTube link on all my marketing tools. Of course, if you do subscribe, you'll be notified of any new videos that I post. So thank you so much again for taking the time to stop by and I hope you enjoy. Thanks.